up royalty nation it's me royalty and i am back with another video guys hopefully this is my last and final video that has anything to do with court the other side anything that is not involving elevation or moving on or you know moving forward but uh got my last court date this morning today the judge will be making his final decision and like I said in my last video, guys, um, I'm really not expecting anything because at the end of the day, I'm not the one who took CJ to court. He took me to court. So like I said, at the end of the day, I'm not really expecting anything. And, you know, um, since I was being pushed to go to trial since the beginning, um, you know, my lawyer just said, take your chances, you know. Even though you're not wanting anything at the end of the day, just, you know, take your chances, do what you got to do. I mean, if they're trying to push trial, why not go along with it? Why not follow through? Why not fight through? So, you know, I did what I did. I took my chances. And, um, you know, like I said, I'm not really expecting anything. I might have to get back on here and tell you guys how everything is. But like I said, this will be my last and final video talking about anything. The other side, child support, child custody, child anything, you know, like I've been wanting to move on for over a year now. So you did what you had to do, which is basically take me to court just to see your kids. And you got that. And at the end of the day, you still wasn't satisfied. I didn't, you know, like I said, I, I didn't took numbers off the table. I didn't took away child support and you still weren't satisfied. At the end of the day, you basically just use the system to try to be in my business, try to get information out of me that I was not sharing with you. And uh, I mean, you still didn't get half the stuff that you wanted anyways. So it's really not an issue over here. But like I said, guys, I will get back with you guys after court and tell you how everything went. And like I said, you know, I'm just praying for mainly I'm just praying for peace, peace of mind. And, uh, you know, just for you to just move on right along. Leave me and my family alone. Leave my kids alone. Do what you got to do for the kids that we do have together. So, I mean, in all reality, if I really wanted anything from you, then I would have took you to court. But uh, that was not the case. So um, I'll get back with you guys after court. It's not um, a physical appearance. Everybody will be on the computer. So we'll see how it goes. Okay, Royalty Nation, court is finally over! You guys don't understand how happy I am. I am just, I'm just happy that I finally get to move on. I don't have to, you know, have another court date. I ain't got to contact my lawyer. I don't have to do any of that. Y'all don't understand. I feel at so I feel like I feel like I'm at peace, guys. I feel so relieved. I feel I feel great. I'm actually happy now that me and my kids we can move on happily ever after. We can just continue to do what we've been trying to do for over a year and just you know you know do our own thing. I mean, people outgrow each other. People outgrow each other, and you know there's nothing wrong with that. I mean, um, it was a long process. It was a long draining. It was a long draining process and you know like you know I did I did tell CJ to take me to court and CJ got what he wanted he wanted to to basically get visitation rights to see his kids and he got that um you didn't get full custody and I didn't have to pay you child support and you don't have to pay me child support at the end of the day guys I've never really asked CJ for anything and if I really did want something from CJ I would have beat him to the punch and I would have took him to court but in all reality guys I'm just finally glad that I can finally move on with my family we can just do what we need to do without anybody being in our business nobody trying to stop anything that we got going on basically that's what you use the law for was just basically to be in my business and try to stop every thing that I try to put forward and um, I'm just glad like I said I'm just thankful and I'm just glad that everything is finalized and everything is done at the end of the day, how I see it in my eyes, it might be different for everybody else in their eyes and from, you know, their own understanding. But from my point of view and from my eyes, I feel like neither one of us won, neither one of us lost. Well, maybe you did lose because I don't have to pay your child support. I don't have to pay your child support. I don't have to pay your court fees and you didn't get full custody of my kids. So 
In all reality, it was it was an even it was an even win for win. You know what I'm saying? So it's like like I said, I really wasn't asking for anything. Um, I dropped child support for you several times. It was brought back on the table because my lawyer was like, you know what? They're taking you to trial, so just take your chances. So it was a good chance that I was not going to get it, and there was a chance that I was going to get it. But just know at the end of the day, guys, I was never expecting it. Um, I've never expected it, so I cannot be mad about something that I never received anyways. So, yeah, you put a little, you put a little stumbling block in my endeavors that I have to do for the, my kids and stuff like that. But, you know, that's easy. Like I said, the hustle that I have for my kids, the love that I have for my kids will always continue. It will never stop. And, yeah, I've been put in a tight bondage because of the court situation. I mean, I had to shell thousands and thousands of dollars for, you know, a peace of mind, basically. But um, at the end of the day, you know, it is what it is. I'm happy. My kids are happy. Now we can just, like I said, right, move right along, continue to do what we have to do. And um, this will just be my last video, just basically talking about anything that has to do with the other side, that has to do with anything with anybody. I wish everybody the best of luck, and I don't care what you guys do in the near future. As long as you keep me and mine's names out of your mouth, Everything could be cool. Everything could be cordial. But just know I'm going to let it mend. I'm going to let it be how it is now. But, you know, it's some things that was said that I do not like. So just know if I were to ever see you out in these streets, just know that is definitely going to be on site. Just know that. So I'm not going to let that slide. I let you slide a couple of times, but, you know, hey, this time we ain't letting that slide. But, um, like, yeah, guys, just know me and my kids, we can move on. We can move forward. And it is what it is, guys. I'm just so happy and thankful that, you know, I really don't have those ties to that person. And yeah, we, we will have these children and we will have to, you know, be in contact with each other for until they are grown. But just know, all jokes aside, guys, I am definitely happy. I finally get my peace. I finally get my peace of mind. I finally get my serenity. Like it's done and over with. So at the other day, guys, I'm not either. I'm not. I'm not sad. I'm not mad. I'm not anything because at the end of the day, I wasn't expecting anything from you, and we gonna keep it at that. With that being said, Royalty Nation, I just want to say I appreciate my nation. I appreciate all of you guys. BSC TV, nothing but the truth. Kiara J. Let's keep it real, Shauna, Sweet Tea, all you guys, I know I'm probably missing some, but I can't name all of y'all, but you just know that I deeply, deeply appreciate y'all, you know, and just moving forward, I just hope everybody can just, you know, keep the peace, keep my name out their mouth, keep my kid's name out their mouth, it's not even that serious anymore, so... I'm just glad that um, I can finally move on with my kids and I do have a big surprise for them. I know they've been waiting for this for I don't know how long. So yeah, Royalty Nation, it is over finally. I just can't believe it. Like basically it was just a year of malarkey. Let's just put it that way. Just a bunch of malarkey, a bunch of just bull crap, but um. It is what it is, and I can finally move on. We can finally do what we need to do and, you know, get back to the bag. A bag is always replaceable. Money is always replaceable. The one thing I am grateful for is my family because family is never replaceable. You can never replace your family. So I'm just thankful that, you know, my kids was down with me and they understood what needed to be done and understood the things that we were going through so kids have a lot of understanding and you know they're very mentally strong and um like i said um moving right along royalty nation can't nothing stop me can't nothing hold me back and like i said i was never upset about something that i never even had so let's get that out the picture you can stop calling us asking us to be in your videos you can ask, stop asking to be in collabs because it ain't going to be none of that. It ain't never going to be none of that. And I think we good where we at. And we always going to be good where we at. Because, you know, the love and the hustle that I got for my kids is never, 
replaceable. And that's one thing I do love about my kids is that they're very understanding. And you know, it ain't nothing but a little bit of get back. So, you know, we just got to get back on our P's and Q's. Get you guys these videos. Get you guys these pranks, these challenges, whatever y'all want. We come in full throttle and big surprise coming for my kids. I know they're going to be very, very ecstatic just as much as I'm going to be ecstatic. But uh, yes, Royalty Nation, please no more mentions like let's let's stop the bull crap. I don't want to have to keep repeating the same stuff, but um, just know from my end, it's no more of that. I've been trying to keep it cool, calm, and cordial, but, uh, you know, when people get a little bit hurt, they like to, you know, talk they hurt. But uh, just no royalty nation. We always going to be good. It ain't never nothing that's holding us back. Everything's replaceable, but just love and your family is never replaceable. So I got some real ones on my side, but I do appreciate you guys, royalty nation, for holding us down. And, uh, yeah. Getting back to this bag. It is what it is. So, moving um, on. It's finally over. It is. It is. I don't want it over. And yes, guess what? Guys. We got a big surprise coming for y'all. For y'all, I got a surprise for y'all as well. But yeah, for all y'all, can I cuss? No, you can't cuss. Bruh. <laughs> But ain't none of that nice stuff. If y'all got something to say, you can oh come God. say it to my face. Look, hold on, hold on. Let me cook. We not on that, Jaleel. No, I'm on that. We not on that. Look, ain't none of that nice stuff. If y'all got something to say, you can say it to my face. Actually, all y'all can line it up for a one, two, three, four, and five. All y'all. And see, I'm not cool with you. We is not friends. We is not going over to your house. No shoes. None of that. No. We are not taking none of your things. We don't want any of that. And we, we're we not cool, actually. No collaborations. When you had the chance, you could have collabed with Funny Mike and all of them. But no, you didn't. And now that we're gone, you would have collabed out of nowhere. Like, make it make sense. Come on now. Like, are you serious? <laughs> but like, we're not on that, Julia. We're moving forward. Everything's over. Everything's done with. So, just no royalty nation. We're moving along. Who are you talking to? It is what it is. And we... That's my grand finale. That's my last and final say-so in what's going on. So, like I said, guys, don't mention the other side to me no more. Because this is y'all last reaction that y'all gonna get out of me. And honestly, guys, I really don't even care. I don't care. Okay? So we're going to get that out the way. And like I said, we're moving on. We're moving forward. Bigger and better things for the royalty family, the royalty nation. And it is what it is. Yep. Right? Yep. That's all we got to say, y'all. So all the other stuff is irrelevant. It's malarkey to me. But um, make sure you guys subscribe, like, hit that notifications bell, and prepare for these videos to be dropping. Because uh, we back in business, y'all. Back in business. Until next time, Royalty Nation, we out!